they're just two things that I like to use with any dog that I'm socializing. Long leads are great because you can in turn practice the come recall and, and I just love them. Um, and I've got one of them on her now. And um, this is the other thing that I'll often use for a reactive dog. And people, it's funny, and I get it, we don't want our dogs to get around looking like Hannibal Lecter. But muzzles can be such a great tool. Um, when you've got a big, strong, reactive dog and you can't quite trust it, but you know you need to do the work, um, a muzzle can just mean that you make so much progress so quickly because you're taking the teeth out of the equation. And it's not something I'm going to jump to with Freya today. I always have a muzzle on me in case I need it. You're sitting on the chair like a person. <laughs> You're a person. So... When you've got an under-socialized dog, you need to do the socialization. You can't put other people's dogs at risk. And the amazing thing about a muzzle is it, 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 it has three, three effects that work really well. The first one is for you to feel secure in knowing that you've got your dog and knowing that your dog can't bite means that you're able to more freely relax whilst just socializing her and that's really important because dogs are very sensitive to our um, our emotions and um, 